Hey everybody, we are here with Sassy. <clears throat> she is in labor, finally. So she is about ready to pop. Um, she's getting some beds ready. She's dug quite a few holes inside this kidding pen. And she's talking. So I think she's just getting everything situated and hopefully we will have some babies this will be the last of the first round of kids for this year crossing my fingers for some little does she's pretty sunk in in the back end so she's loosening up nice. She's literally dug to the ground. And I am going to try to get as much of this birth as possible. Her udder is quite large. So I am just going to get some puppy pads ready here. She moved a uh, <clears throat> she moved around a lot last year, so um, I'm not sure if she's going to move around as much or the same amount. She likes to get up and lay down, get up and lay down. Um, and the other girls are just kind of lay down and push so she likes to dig to China <laughs> quite literally before she starts heck I even think last year she ended up having like at least one or two standing up she lost her ligaments really late last night um, and I was almost thinking she was going to go in the middle of the night, but turns out she didn't because we are here now to hopefully see this wonderful birth. <laughs> I should probably go run in and grab my towels too, just in case, since it is cold out tonight. <clears throat> it's about, I would say like, Maybe around four o'clock or so. So since they are gonna come out quite wet and it is chilly, I might go grab those. I just washed them. So let me go grab those and let me just let you hang out with her for a sec. I'll be right back.
got my towels. ready okay she is starting to push now I've got you a little bit closer on the tripod so I might end up getting in the way of the camera but I want to try this this time to see if I get any better angles she's a pro mom she's done this lots of times so you might end up seeing me move the phone around a couple of times. But I'll still give her the same amount of care as I do everybody else. Let's see. You got a mama. No bubble just yet. Sorry, I'm messing with my tripod. Oops. Especially since I know that she's one that gets up and moves, I am going to have to probably like move my phone around a couple of times. But like I said, I'm going to try to get as much of this as I can. Um, just know that it's only me, so... If I miss some footage, I will try to do my best. Nothing up there yet, sweetheart.
still somewhat comfy, preferably not up against the fence. phone. Almost there. Lay down. Come on, little babies. Get out of here. Good girl. I know. There you go, mama. move my phone any further back. Oh. That's as best as I can get. Sorry, guys. No, oh, babies. Ooh. Big gush. Oh, okay. Not comfy yet? It's not a baby though. You don't have to worry about that. Me clean it up for you. I'll clean it up for you. Good girl, Sass. She is also very, very good at cleaning up after herself. <laughs> like last year, um, I'm pretty sure she like pretty much ate all of her placenta and everything. And some, some goats don't do that, some do. right up against a wall. Sweetheart.
She's a really good mob. She likes to clean them off. So I kind of let her do most of that. I do want to make sure though that we got the face cleared off. How's your face? I guess is a buckling. Let's see. Uh, I can't tell. Uh, nope, it's a little girl. We got a little doe. is in my way. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's I'll help you a little bit. Most of the ooey gooey's off. Yeah. have a lot to clean. Okay, mama. I'll take care of it. I got it. I got it, baby. I got it, baby. Oh, that's it. Hold on. Yeah, push out another one right over there. Really? I can't get to that one. Here, let's turn you around. Can you turn around, please? Mom? Why don't you bring me there? Okay, can I see your back end? I can't get it when you're over there. There. Nah, I can at least see what's going on. Good mama. Ready with my puppy pad. Yes. Stand again. Another pretty big contraction.
Pop. Well, yeah, you look like a little girl. Sorry, guys, I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you can see. Puppy pads. Gonna pop out another. Yep. Uh, backwards again. Good girl. <laughs> I also want to try to get them out of their sacks as fast as possible. Like I said, it is cold out here. So I do want them to get cleaned off. Usually, like I said, I like her to do it herself. But she is known to have a lot of kids. this. Go see your babies. Your babies are right over there. There you go. Good girl. Good girl. I know. I need to go grab another puppy pad. Has triplets. I don't know. We'll see. She had quads last year. Over here to this pad, because we're a little cleaner. You throw this one away, Mom. I'll toss that one out. That one for you. 
I knew you weren't done. Seriously? <laughs> Sorry, bad view. You done? No, you're not done. I need a couple more puppy pads, sweetheart. Don't pop it out yet. Oh my goodness, her babies are everywhere. I can't keep them contained. Okay, I'll just let them move. I'll focus on what's coming. Okay, so we got four on the ground right now. And I'm pretty sure there's at least one more coming. We had this happen last time. With a pop a sack. There we go. Oh my god. Oh, that was a lot. A lot of fluid. It's okay. I get it. I get it off of your face. I know. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. There. Oh my god. You're so slippery. done, right?
should just be a water sack. I don't think there's a baby in that. <laughs> Holy <laughs> bad word. <laughs> This one kind of came out in a big sack, and I'm trying to get it a little bit more lively. I mean, it's alive. It's just got a... My bubble bulb sucker things inside the house. I left it in the house. Okay. There you go. Cough it out. Dude, you're getting... Cough it out. so many. You gonna make a naked little guy? Girl, I don't know what you are. Cough it out here, mama. Look that one. Look that one. Oh, come out running. I'm going to help mom dry these guys off with a towel. I don't even know who came out at one point. I don't even know. Okay, I'm gonna set you right there. Here we go, Mama. Here we go. We're gonna get them all right here on this towel. All right here on the towel. All right here on the towel. Oops. Jesus. Where's your little one? It's running away. Come here. Oh. Oops, sorry. I sorry, I knocked you on the head. Look 
looking at mom. Okay. I am going to cut this right here because I got a lot of babies to deal with. So, um, I'll be back later. Okay, so I am just uh, in the pen here with Sassy and her quintuplets. So we had five. Um, it was very, very crazy after the birth. Um, trying to get everybody dried off and uh, warmed up because she can only do so much. She only has one tongue. <laughs> so... Um, we did really well, though. They're all nice and dry. I am pretty sure they all have had some sort of colostrum. Um, I'm going to try this little girl again. Um, but we had five dolings. We had five girls. Yes. I cannot believe it. Like, the last kidding of this season basically so i might have some fall kids coming but um the last kidding of spring season is done and we had five girls oh my goodness i am so extremely excited i am I want all of these girls to go to performance homes. That would be absolutely amazing um, to be able to see that happen. But we will see. We have a chocolate buckskin. We have a regular buckskin. And we have three chocolates. And they all have some sort of white splashing on them. So um, there's that. All have white poles. All are going to be horned. Um... And brown eyes. And she she dropped her placenta right after I put all the fresh straw in here. I should have waited to put fresh straw, but uh, she had, like I said earlier, dug to China. So I wanted to make sure that she um, had a nice dry spot for her kids. So, um, mom is doing good. I'll try not to show all the blood on the ground. But... We're all good. So I will put little coats on them tonight um, just to make sure that they are extra warm um, because it is supposed to be in the mid-20s, I think, tonight. So that's not too bad, but I do want to make sure everybody makes it through the night. So I am super excited to have all of these girls. So, yeah. Now I'm just going to make sure everybody's nice and warm. And this one's falling asleep. They're all like halfway asleep. That one over there is falling asleep. So I'll make sure that they all get food in their bellies. Um, I did grab a bottle, so I've got a little bit of claustrum in there. But um, mom's udder is massive, so I will probably be able to take some of that colostrum and freeze it. But um, I want to make sure everybody gets their fill first. Yes, you're so cute. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe it. Look at you. You are going to climb on me? Huh? Oh, it's going to lay down. Oh, that's looking for. I'm not the milk producer. I'm sorry. I'll give you some in a bottle if you want that. Okay, well, I'm going to sign off for the night. And we will see you on the next one. If you want to um, follow along with the growth of these kids, I'm going to try to do as many videos as I possibly can. But I did get a new job, so... Um, I will definitely try to put out content as they grow, but if you want to keep close tabs on their growth and everything, uh, go ahead and follow me over on Facebook at Lakeview Dairy Goats, and, um, I will be posting lots of baby goat content over there or pictures and updates, um, and then I'll try to post content over on this side. 
but like and subscribe and click the notification bell so you can be notified the next time a video goes out and uh, i will we'll see you on the next one have a good night bye <laughs>